Hey peeps, it's your girl Blessed D. Gazadeva and welcome back to the Blessed D. Gazadeva channel and people, the pastor is keeping from last week into this week. So again, we have another video with the pastor talking to the police, sitting in front of the police, having a conversation about what happened and how he was thinking of his arcs, entrance, etc. Anyway, people, when we get back, we're going to look into it, we're going to break it down, we're going to talk about it. Let's kick it. <laughs> We're going to watch the video real quick and after the, we watch the video, I'm going to give my opinion on what is what with Kevin Smith and what I've watched in all the videos with Kevin Smith to date. So Kevin Smith is charismatic. Whether we want to agree or whether we want to disagree, he is charismatic. And for those of you who don't know what charisma is, all it simply means is the ability to compel devotion from others. That's all it means. And Kevin has mastered the art of that. <laughs> No, but just at 9 o'clock, you have to open the heart. Rapture is raptus, which is really torture. That is what the rapture is. I come with salvation. I do not come to rape my people of their freedom, of their breath. You have to pay in this nation to walk your footprint, foot carbon footprints. If you march in this nation, you must pay. If you breathe in this nation, you must pay. Do you not understand that fear of has built his great house and he is stepping on your necks. Era tried to bring me down, but I am that I am. All you people of the world, I came to you in this form. I am Samasa, born in Glengoff, Isaba, Victoria, the year of Jubilee and victory. What? What happened? Oh, hospital, mat. They made my life a mat. I suffered, I bled. Look at this night when I came to call all of my sheep, the stray sheep from the 12 tribes and nations. The thunder comes, the cloud comes, and the rain comes. But you did not believe my report. I am the fountain of life. I am the Catherine, the Catherine Peak. I come from St. Catherine. That's why you gave me water from where I come from. St. Catherine, Jamaica is where I was born. I have fulfilled all things. At the age of nine years old, the angel of the Lord came and spoke to this body and asked me if I would give the eternal yes. I have given the eternal yes. I came as Jonah the one. But they mocked me and they scuffed me. They surrounded me and they looked at me and said, Who is this man? Because man, God was tabernacled in man's seed of men. I carry the government. I spoke about it last night. I'm going to talk about it again. So Kevin has mastered the art of understanding that there are a lot of impoverished poor people in Jamaica. I was watching the TVJ walkthrough of the church last night and you saw rice bags of rice tons of food and a fridge with a lot of chicken in it unfortunately nobody wants those chicken because they know what happened in the church but nonetheless i'm sorry it went to waste but you can see that kevin to what people said fed the community now always remember that is one of the key leadership which is what i understand that them pian pian government here, they have no sense. They feed people once a year. And to be honest, let me take back that, them have sense. That's why them send out the chicken back and the flour when it comes to election time. Because people can always be caught with their stomachs. Bagawaya did it to Marcus Garvey. Sell him out for rice and peas. That's my granny tell me. And there is more some truth to it because I've heard it over and over again. Now... Kevin has mastered the art of understanding that a lot of people don't have work, a lot of people are not intelligent, a lot of people are not well-read, and a lot of people do not have basic knowledge to make decisions on their own. 
There are a lot of broken homes in Jamaica. So when somebody is going to look and say, oh, Kevin shouldn't have gotten away with this, I, Gaza Diva, don't look at it as that. Kevin will always get away with things like this. And there is more than one Kevin. There are many Kevins. I am pretty sure I read the comments on the video I made with the voice note and a lot of you are distraught. You're upset and you're like, how could this happen? But you saw Kevin in church. You see Kevin standing up. Everybody wants to touch off of him. Kevin has cultured himself in such a way in the church, put himself as the caregiver for these people in the church and because of that they have become indebted to him and by indebted to him i mean they are loyal to him they believe in what he says even if it's a lie they want to be associated with him because when they look at kevin they think at their level whether you believe it or not he's intelligent he lives in a big home. He is well off and he is down here dealing with us. You notice in the parade how they were putting brooches on him because they are enamored by him. They are so captivated by Kevin's charisma. So this is why I'm saying Kevin has used charisma and charm to captivate the people in PCC, in the Pathway Ministry Church. If Kevin did not catch the people who needed help because they were improvised or below living standards or didn't have a job, Kevin was able to catch the blege blege church goers. And by blege blege church goers, what do I mean? You have a lot of people who go to church because of excitement. You have a lot of people who attend church because the pastor full of vibes. You have a lot of people who attend church because they can dance, skip, fling chair, jump over the pulpit, boom flick, split, sideways, turn around and act as if they are in the spirit. But I'm going to say again, God is not the author of confusion. Half of what you see Kevin is able to get away with in the church is allowed. It is not getting away with it. He is allowed to do it. The massive crave it, so he continues to do it. If Kevin was not making money from what he was doing, he wouldn't continue to do it. If Kevin did not have a committed audience, he wouldn't continue to do it. Now he has a committed audience from which or who he's making money from weekly, monthly or whatever. You see all the stories out there. I don't have to tell you how and what he has done to make his money and how much he's raking in. You see all those other videos. If Kevin did not have a nest that his eggs, for a lack of a better phrase, were hatching in, he would have given up this long ago. But he realized that it's a lucrative business. He realized that people are, quote-unquote, as we call them, for fool, stupid, ear the voice note yesterday, which is very sad for an elderly woman to be putting Jesus in her foolishness because she wants to follow foolishness. She wants to go into the church. She wants to jump up and down. She wants to boom flick. She wants to slide. She wants to split because you can see that she and hear by how she interacts that she is one of those persons. And this is why I say there are many Kevins in Jamaica. Kevin just got caught. And there are many more to be revealed. 
And when they reveal, just remember Gaza Diva did tell you that. Anyway, people, tell me your thoughts down below in the comment section. And as per usual, we'll have a discussion. If you've not yet subscribed to my channel, please hit the notification bell. And if you've not yet smashed the like button on this video, smash the like button and send this out. I'm out.